So the time to set this up is just almost makes it not worth it, but it is worth it. Just setting these, the rail up, the saw up, the Panther Pro, um, it just takes a while. Make sure all those your measure, measurements are right. So first off, I picked this up for 20 bucks. It was a eight foot, uh, 16 foot ladder. And I'm gonna use it to make a good flat cut. There's the Panther Pro's mill. I think that's a 42, 48, 42. There's the good old uh, copy, MS660. And then I have a um, Carlton ripping chain on there. The way that I fastened these was with, I think three inch long wood screws that I drilled holes in. I chipped out some of the bark, made sure that it was all level, and that just kind of goes through a couple inches down. Um, so here's kind of the setup, and uh, bear with me as I attempt to cut this nice chunk of oak.
heard some people say that after you're done, especially milling the saw for a while, you want to let it idle. That basically, I guess my understanding is it cools off the engine. Those high revs um, thin out the oil or actually will lean it out. So um, as it idles, it can get some fresh, cool fuel in there. So uh, there it is, the first cut. Uh, really surprised how that Carlton uh, ripping chain did. I mean, I didn't have to do the back and forth at all. A little, little bumpy in here, but um, that'll uh, plane out really good. So I'm kind of thinking a uh, little end table, a little miniature coffee table. And um, so to stay tuned for the uh, next cut. Hope you like my videos. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, share. Uh, throw me your hate your way. I know a lot of people have issues with that uh, MS660 Chinese saw. I actually had some videos taken down of me just cutting up against uh, my uh, normal steel 660. But uh, hey, it runs. I took out the decomp plug just because it was oozing out, and I just, I just, it's another piece that can fail. And if it fails right there, you're sucking in air. Get a little bit lean condition, uh, 24 inch bar and chain, like I was saying, 10 degree, right there, 10 degree, not like the Granberg, the Granberg has like another little line here, uh, scores it, cuts it a little bit better, but hey, for some dry, tight grain oak, that blew through it pretty quick. Uh, stay tuned for, for more videos, have a wonderful evening, adios.